91.5 The Beat, Hit Music Radio. That is Danny Fernandez with Private Dancer. Good morning. It's 8.40, Friday, September 19th. You got Mocha and Adele. And you got an incredible day today. Beautiful sunshine and a high of 21. Outside the Beat Studios right now, it is 8. All right. Once again, joining us in the Beat Studios is KW's most eligible bachelorette. Mm -hmm. Her name is Tia. She's tall, has long, dark hair, Mm. luscious lips. Yes. And she's got a great booty. And I can say that because we've been girls for, I don't know what, like 15 years. 15 years. And I can right. say that because, well, you've got an incredible booty. <laughs> 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 Plain and simple. I'm not going to lie. So you went on a date last night, your second date. You went yep. to Peter Martin's 20 King Street restaurant, downtown Kitchener, which I absolutely love. Yes. And the Flying Dog, another place I love for some salsa dancing. How, how did mm-hmm. it go? How was your date? What, what was his name, first of all? Keith. Keith. He was his name, yep. He was a really nice guy. Um, I can't say there was a love connection, Uh-oh. but uh, definite sweetheart, and we'll probably be dancing partners. Really? Know. Good oh, dancer? Yeah. Is he good? Yeah, he's not bad, um, but uh, I think we need a little practice. So. A little practice? Yeah. Well, come on. I mean, <laughs> a lot of people don't dance on their no, first very, day, right? No, very, very true. It's very personal. That's kind of close. Did he step mm-hmm. on your toes? No, 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 nothing like that. We huh. just didn't really have a lot of time, so. Yo, how's uh, Tim, the limo driver? Tim was MIA last night. What? What? But I had a really cute fill-in lady. She was sweet. What was yeah. her name? Um, oh, my goodness. Cutie? Blanked. Yeah, she was an absolute wonderful woman. Shout out to Redline Limousine for providing that service all night yes. as well. Yeah, thank, thank you. Thank you very much. Mm-hmm. So what kind of stuff did you guys talk about? Or was it kind of awkward? Like, um, It was a little awkward, but uh, it was okay. Yeah. Did yeah. he have bad breath? No, Adele. <laughs> she didn't have. I she always know. wants to ask me that. Really? <laughs> well, talk about what was he wearing? Was it was uh, it quite impressive? Like when you first saw him, was it? Or, yeah. Dress shirt, um, pants. Come on, shoes. T. Give us some juice. See, here's the thing, okay? And I've lived with her. I, I think lived she's with lying. You for like two years. You, you're nice. Yeah. Give us the dirt. Come on, sister. Spill the beans. Well, what was really sweet was that he brought me a rose. Oh yeah, hand picked. No, I want to hear some ju- I want to hear some juicy Tough. details. Did he have hair coming out of his nose <laughs> no, or his ears? Didn't. No, 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 no. Tia, the music's off. We need to know. Give us the real deal. <laughs> Did you kiss him? No, no kiss. Did he try? No. Not even a handshake. It was a little hug. Yeah. Okay, you're okay. a really boring bachelorette. Like, can you not give us some saucy <laughs> details? <laughs> if there was something to tell, I'd tell. Maybe uh, date number three will be a little bit more juicy. All yeah. Right. Well, just so you know, we're installing cameras in the limo. Mm. No, I'm only playing. <laughs> so excited about that. All right. If you <laughs> fellas out there, all the uh, bachelors in town, if you would like to take Tia out on a date, all expenses paid. You'll get picked up in a limo. We'll take you out for dinner and pay for the whole thing. You can log on to our website, 915thebeat.com. You can see uh, Tia's picture. You got a profile on there, and you can mm-hmm. even sign up and, and tell us a little bit about yourself. Quick question, because I've known you for years, and you're, you know, I remember living with you and having to keep my clothes in the garage because there wasn't enough room. <laughs> for all my so for all rock. My stuff because your shoes you have more shoes than anyone that I know in the world how do you get dressed for something like this mm-hmm. how do you get and she's got like 18,000 pairs of shoes 18,000 right. different colors of, of shirts um, P.S. Adele is the exact same way oh yeah. we know um, that <laughs> but uh, I guess it all starts with either the shoes mm-hmm. or a color that you feel like wearing so it's all about your mood, right? Yeah. So you're wearing purple today, which means you're sexually frustrated. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Really? It does mean that, Adele. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. No, Kay. it's the fashion trend. Okay, don't hit me. You can't hit me. Nobody can see that. What? She's my girl. I'm allowed to ask no, these you questions. No, you still got step in. Oh. It's girl talk. Well, you're talking about being sexually frustrated. You're talking to the right guy. <laughs>